what is up everybody welcome back to the channel and welcome to another video so i apologize if you're getting some wind noise it's windy down here in santa clarita so um we are going to do a couple of videos so while i'm waiting for the battery to charge on the drill to do the v-board video um we are going to show you guys how to take care of the wood on a on your uh, step deck or your flatbed trailer so um i grabbed some wood sealer while i was in home depot uh for one for the trailer and for two i'm going to put the wood sealer on the wood that i got for the v-boards right here as well that way you know hopefully they just last longer overall as well so but um if you can tell the wood on the deck of the trailer you know throughout the winter it has taken a beating so and there's no reason to just let the wood go to go to crap you know what i mean if you can protect it and make it last longer you might as well so it's just one less expense so uh, a gallon of wood sealers like you know depending on what you want it's 10 to 20 bucks at home depot um you know put it on in the spring and again in the fall and then that should you know help protect the wood on your trailer throughout the year so but so we're going to go through and protect the wood on the trailer so what we grabbed was this olympic water guard wood sealer here uh the one that i got I think this one was 15 bucks so it's just clear you know no special colors you don't need anything special you know it repels water blocks against sun uh, it's mildew resistance and it you know penetrates the surface for protection and then uh, you know where it's just a trailer you don't have to be real careful if you get it on the metal or whatnot so and then I just grabbed you know this little throwaway roller this is like five bucks or something so all together you're 20 bucks and you're going to be able to uh, you know do your whole trailer probably a couple of times with a gallon i would assume so um when i was back working with cox trucking i noticed they would do their conestogas you know two three times a year but the wood on their trailer has always looked amazing and so um, I've always wanted to do it to this trailer. This trailer's brand new. Um, well, it's a year old now, but it's still brand new. So there's no reason to just let it get beat up. So with that being said, let's put some of this uh, wood sealer in this little uh, paint trough or whatever you want to call it. And let's get to sealing this trailer. Let's keep this trailer nice. So. You know, this is this is how we make our money, so we might as well keep what makes us money nice, right? So, let's get this done. Alright guys, as you can see, I got that poured out into the, into the little paint trough. I can't remember what the crap these things are called, but I'm calling the paint trough, so you can correct me if you want to. But So, we'll just get our roller nice and wet, and then we'll start going up and down the wood here. Alright guys, so we're just going to get some on this roller, then just essentially just roll it on. Tell you what, this wood is dry though. Holy crap, that sucked that up really quick. But the little uh, six inch roller right here is the perfect size, that's for sure, with these little two by sixes. Obviously, you know, that kind of sounded stupid, but it's working really well. So, and 
just let it all soak in so let it get that good penetration that we all like so much there you go there's number one so but I don't know if you can tell the difference between that see that dry wood here on this one the one on the right so boys and girls there you have it so all the wood on the deck has been treated took me oh 10 minutes or something so you know it worked really good on the outside the outsides are one by six these inside ones are one by five or two by five sorry two by sixes two by fives but um as you can see it's all nice wood so don't mind my mess down here so, like I said, I didn't really care about getting it on the aluminum too much because, you know, it's just going to come off anyways with just put material. I know some people, you know, they would want to mask it off and all that kind of stuff. Uh, I'm not that worried about, you know, a little bit of this stuff getting on the, on the deck. So, but that's it. It's that easy. A gallon of wood seal and a roller and a little roller tray so in that little tray that I have actually came with two rollers so I used one roller to do the deck and then I'm using another roller to do all the wood for the v-boards so but anyways I appreciate you guys for watching uh, and I'll see y'all on the next video